G'day everybody, the Antipodean bloke here. Welcome back to uh, my playthrough of Kingdom Come Deliverance. Last episode was uh, us going hunting with uh, Sir Hans Capon and uh, him coming a cropper with a bunch of humans from which we rescued him and uh, won our way into his good graces. Now, no sooner had we returned to safety back in Rat-Eye then uh, word came that the stables at Neuhof had been raided and that uh, Smil, the uh, vassal of Lord Hanush, had been killed and uh, men were being sent there to investigate what had happened. This included me, Henry, with my uh, new horse. So uh, we're going to pick up just as we're leaving the dining hall in Ratai and getting ready to ride to Neuhof to investigate exactly what has happened. So here we go. The hunt begins. Let's play. Show me what you've got concealed. Oh. What's going on? Where's the trust, I tell Such you? Such are my orders. Yeah, yeah, search oh, me. Come on, then. <clears throat> All right, you can go. He's annoying. Righto, down into the courtyard and check in with Bernard and pick up my new horse. Here we go. Are you ready? Oh yeah. I was ready, born ready. Good. Then follow me. Keep quiet and do exactly as you're told. I don't know what Sir Radzik sees <sighs> in you and I don't care. If you're to ride with my men, I expect you to This listen. man really is a donkey. But, go along, yes, get along. Against all better judgment, they've decided to give you your own horse. The dappled gray beside my stallion is yours. Make sure you take good care of him. Now, mount up and ride behind us. Yes, sir. No, sir. Three bags full, sir. Okay, dappled gray. This is the one. Right, up. Pebbles. No Last one there won't find me a happy man. Young little stallion for me. And uh European knights always rode stallions. Never mares. I guess it was one of those macho things. But look at this. My own horse. Bloody wonderful. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. This is a little bit of a boring ride along. So, uh, if I can make sure I do it right, I might just edit out the scenery. Don't worry, there's going to be plenty of opportunity. To admire the scenery of this beautiful world but um, yeah Where's your master? In in the paddock. Yeah, that would be smell. Oh, what's left of him? <sighs> Crucifix. What kind of beasts could do this? By the blood of the martyrs. <laughs> 
I do not like violence against animals. What happened here? Why? I really do not. Someone came at night and hamstrung every one of them. The horses Bastards. screaming must have woke poor Radek, the stable boy. And when he tried to stop them. And then my husband, when my husband tried to help them, they killed him too. And when they were done, they put a torch to the stables. My sincere condolences, ma'am. I swear we'll hunt those monsters down and make them pay for this. The horses were still alive when I came. We had to finish them off. All of them. The pain in their eyes. They couldn't understand how anyone could do this to them. Did they steal anything? Any horses? Nothing. I only imagine they wanted the blood, not coin. Of having to finish off your own horses. Bloody nightmare. Did your me. husband quarrel lately? Was there anyone who might want revenge? He argued over the price of a saddle, maybe, but nothing, nothing that could drive a man to this. Bloody man. These are dark days when there's more kindness in horses than in men. Did you see anything? How many were there? Or what did they look like? We saw no one. Has anyone tried to follow the trail? No. We were fighting the blaze until now, and even if we weren't, what chance would any of us have against someone who could do this? It's my way here now. Let's track these bastards down. A pox on it. Mount up and quarter the area. We have to find out where they went. Look for tracks and ask the folk if they saw anyone. Fuck, someone must have at least caught sight of them. Yes, yes sir. sir. What about me, Captain? What the hell use are you? You stay here. Please, let me do something. I could have a look around the area and see if they left any tracks. Well, if you must. Just don't get in anyone's way. Don't go too far, and come back here when you're done. Bernard, you are a jerk. Right. Well, I guess we'll start by, uh... Speaking with Smell's widow. Smell, the stud farm owner. I saw him in Scarlet's a few times. His poor widow. Can't imagine she'll really want to say anything, but... Ask. I... I can come back later if you... No. I saw you came with the soldiers, and the sooner you know everything, the sooner you'll catch those savages. I agree. I'm sorry to trouble you, ma'am, but could you tell me about the raid? The noise woke us up. Me and Smill. We thought the horses were restless, or maybe some drunk had staggered here from the inn. Do you get drunks coming here a lot? Right. Sometimes, but not this time. My husband went out to see what was going on. Then I just heard loud voices and screaming. It's so stupid. It didn't even occur to me at first that something could have happened to Smill. I didn't find out until the morning. Okay, so did you recognise any of the voices you heard? Who were no, but they spoke Czech, the place. cursing like demons, even at each other. At each other, they quarrelled. Yes, something must have happened. Right, so they spoke Czech, so they're not humans. And where did you hear this noise? Everywhere. It was chaos. I don't even know how many of them there were. I mean at the very start. Do you remember where you heard the noise come from then? I don't know. I just don't know. Oh, it's the middle of the night. Let's ask about 
That big bastard who took my father's sword. Did you get a look at them? There's one man, huge and dressed all in black. Did you see him? No, I didn't. Okay, well, she wasn't out with everybody when it was going down. Who should I question about the raid? Did anyone here see anything? From what I've heard, Mark was the first one to wake. Okay, it might be a good idea to talk to him. Ginger was sleeping in the stable. He might Ginger? have seen something. Jakob, the old stable boy. He even Jakob. fought with them. I don't know of yeah, anyone Good on else. you, Jakob. Right. Now, who's this guy over here? Which one is he? Or is he one of them? Yep, that's Jakob. He's a bit messed up. Now... Yeah. Another useless soldier coming to ask questions. You should have fucking been here last night. Yeah, he's angry. I got some first aid skills, so I've got an option to uh, ask to look at his wounded arm. What's wrong with your arm? That's nasty. It needs to be cleaned out and bandaged. Let me. Hmm. That feels a mite better. I like that. Thank you. What do you need to know? My skills gave me some more speech options. Okay, so what happened What in the here? world happened here? Um, the bastards attacked us. Attacks. At night, a little before dawn. dawn. And how did you come by that wound? I heard someone talking, so I went to look outside. Then I saw what they'd done to the horses. I shouted at those bastards. Caught one by okay, the cloak. So they did the horses beam. first. Without a weapon? With just your fists? Yeah. But he cut me pretty good, the fucker. Lucky for me, the other side to come out then, so the raiders run. Good on you, Yaku. All that's left Good is on you, mate. And you've got no idea why they did it. Something must have gone wrong for them. They ran off without taking anything. Right, so not about the thievery. It's more about the killing the horses. There's what? one man in particular, huge, dressed all in black, voice loud enough to crack stone. Did you see him? Who the fuck do you think half killed me? So he really was here. The bastard. Can you help and... me? How? You know the area. How can I figure out which way they went? Hmm. They left in a hurry. You could see if there's a fence knocked down. Or a gate. Yep, I can do that. Easy. Farewell. Oh, thank you, Jakob. You've been a help. Now, which way? Okay, out this way. And just taking a quick look. You know, got to check these things out. Got to just make sure everything's locked up good and tight. Because, you know, there has been a raid, um, and, you know, it's quite possible that they could uh, claim on their insurance policy for any loss or damage, so I won't mind if I just mm, take some of that. And Look, just going to check the locks on this one as well, make sure they're okay. Hope I don't get busted. Um, oh shoot, that's all right. Very nice, very nice indeed. <clears throat> Let's try not to think of the foot of thievery. Oh, Papa Dog, where'd you go? Come here, you. Yeah, praise the boy. There's the good doggy. That's my boy. I think it's been a while since I fed him as well. Hey, a new level in Houndmaster. Look what I've got for you. That's good stuff. You'll love this. What have I got? Hey, you still got some uh, rabbit meat. There we go. Just a little bit of that. That's all good. Okay, where were we? Heading out this way. 
that way, it's to the north. How could anyone be so cruel? Because corpse there. Burnt building there. Poor wretch. He must have crawled here. If it was the horses they were after, uh, there'll be even more of them by the main stables. Right, so I'm assuming that's this way. Well, fire did a job on that, didn't it? Such senseless brutality. Yep. They slaughtered horses as well as people, and yet it seems they didn't take anything. Yes, they did. They broke into two chests, remember? Nudge, nudge, wink, How wink. How could anyone be so cruel? Uh, How could anyone be so cruel? Rosie? Okay, that's all the same. Okay, Mark. He was one of the people I had to talk to. <laughs> Are you... Are you well? Leave me alone. Stupid question, Go Henry. Away. Yep. There's no need to be afraid. With your help, I'll find those bastards and then I'll make them pay. They... they deserve it. Certainly what, do. What do you need to know? What actually happened here? Okay. They... Killed they the killed animals? The animals and... <laughs> Why did they kill them? Not making too much sense, they take really. Anything? No. Think carefully now. How did it all start? We... We heard the animals. Their shrieks. Then Smill. He shouted. Mm -hmm. And they murdered him. You're certain it was the animals first, and then Smill? Not the other way round? I'm certain. I'd never heard a sound like that before. Now I'll never forget it. What happened after that? Mm. We ran outside and it was chaos. Animals were dying, the stables were burning, and those demons everywhere. Demons? You said they were demons? No, just... All right, gotcha. Uh, stables were burning right from the start. The stables start. were already burning. Were they? Didn't that happen after they fled? No. It was to set the blaze when they arrived. How many of them were there? Not many. Mm. So it seems to be more about there just wanton just destruction and uh, us, but more terrorizing. I heard them yelling at Nothing each other. about money. So they were yelling because of all the noise? No, something happened. They quarreled. In the back? Where? Mm. Towards the woods. To the north. They were trying to get away. Okay, so there was a falling so some out of them were running amongst away and the, the others raiders. Were fighting. Aye, for a time. Then more of us came out and we fought back, so the others fled as well. So all about. Uh, where did they flee? You said to where? the north. Where did they run to? To the north. Yep, right. Into got the it. wood. Uh, that's Thanks. all. That's all I needed to ask. Right. Watch over you. <laughs> Let's see other stables. Uh huh. I want to just quickly take a, a look in here. You know, just to make sure everything's still there. Um. Nah. Another. Mm. No horses here. Oh, hello. Yep, yeah, definitely a ginger. Who's there? Easy. I just came to ask. I don't know anything. Are you hurt? No, no, nothing. Not a scratch. Mm-hmm. What really happened here? I don't know. Someone attacked. I, I don't know who. Ginger, you are sounding a bit sketchy. You didn't happen to hear where they came from? No. I didn't see a thing. I believe you. 
I don't believe you at all. Right. To the north. That's the fence line. There's a gate. That's been knocked down. Aha! This wasn't done by animals. They must have gone into the woods this way. Hmm. Right. Blood tracks. Let's follow these into the woods. Grab some St. John's Wort while I'm walking past it. They went deeper and deeper, for sure. Just going to double check. Yep, shield's ready. Come. Oh. Oh. Ah. Ah. Damn it! Hey! Oh shit! It's giving me a hiding! Come on! You're dead! Half dead! Yeah. Ah. Not quite! Come on, boy! Jesus Christ! Got him. Let's get that away. You look messed up. <laughs> I'm fucking dying here. <laughs> Nobody can yes, catch you me are. with iron in their hands and uh, <laughs> some damn peasant kills me. <laughs> Dagger covered in horse shit. <laughs> Very dramatic. Right. Press item, bloody hoof pick. I'll take that. Why, it's a hoof pick. Someone in Neuhof must know more about it. Ooh, brown felt hat. Right oh nice. What do you got on your sunshine? Ah, right. Karate Camperson, don't want that. Working boots, leather gloves, thank you. Communion chalice, nice. Uh, another pair of was it chalices? And a marigold decoction. And some hair meat. Take that too. Now you can see down low, that guy got a couple of really good sword strokes in on me. So I'm going to. Oh, come on. How come that's hot? I killed him fair and square. Right. Marigold decoction is for wounds. So what I'm going to do. I'm actually going to take two of them. And hopefully that will help cure me a little. Right. Let's go back. Captain Robard. And tell him what we found. There were bandits here. Two of them. Right there to the north in the woods. What? You saw them? 
They attack me and I... They're dead. Yes. You killed them? One of them. The other was already dying. He had this on him. It must be from the stud farm. All right. Ask the folk here about it. I'll take the men and scout the woods. Yeah, well, that's the... That's the hoof pick. I'll ask Jakob about that. Hoof pick. Do you know anything about this hoof pick? Yeah. It's Ginger's. He had it made in mate. Told you it was sus. Any idea where I might find this Ginger? Yeah, well, out of the stable. That's the thing. He packed up and left. What? Oh, little Look, bastard. I, I know how he looks. But Ginger is a fine fellow. I, I don't believe he had anything to do with the attack. Then why run? Where could he have Where could he have to? I, I might know. But you gotta promise me one thing. When you find him, listen to what he has to say before judging. Yeah, that sounds fair. You have my word. Sometimes the charcoal burners come to see him. He gets on well with them. Okay. I think that's where he's gone. And where is that? No idea. They've always kept to themselves, you know, charcoal burners. But the forest is full of they like the millers. It could be anywhere. Aye, except these ones won't be far. If you follow the stream from the stud farm towards Rate, you'll come across one of their camps. Only. Only what? Ginger didn't go that way, though. He always went by the big road, through the woods in the direction of Ujits. But how can I find them? There's always smoke when they work. <laughs> You'll smell them before you see them. Yeah, well, yeah. And they need to be near water. There's that too. So yeah. if I go through the woods along running water, I'll find them? Exactly. Right, right, right. Okay. Now... Is that water? Yeah. Where's my pony? There you are. Okay. Charcoal burners are that way. down here. Now, let's go find them. Yeah. Right. Charcoal burners. Oh, some sage. Yeah, that's good. Um, yeah. Hey, spokesman. Good day to you. Hello, you. Could you help me? Depends what you want, doesn't it? Ginger. I'm looking for Ginger, a stable boy from Neuhof. They say he ran away and joined up with some charcoal burners he used to hang around with sometimes. Sorry, there's never been a lad called Ginger around here. You have to try somewhere else. Um... Yeah. A murder's been committed at Neuhof, and that boy likely knows who did it. It's vital I find him. There's been murder aplenty in these parts of late, but that ginger lad really hasn't been here. There'll be a lot less murdering going on once I bring those bastards to justice, so how about helping me out? Calm down, lad. For the love of God, there's been no one like the boy you want round here. But then again, there are other charcoal burners. Try them. Where you might I? want to hurry. You're not the first to be asking about him. And the others weren't exactly a noble-looking bunch, although they were generous with their silver. They didn't happen to say what they wanted him for? No, but they definitely didn't look like they wanted to invite him to a feast. Do you have any idea where else he could have gone? You said he was friends with the charcoal burners? Well, yes. you'll definitely find some in the forest between Neuhof and Ujets. There's good spots Ujets. around there. Yep. But that forest is huge. I could spend weeks searching. Then follow the river. That's how you found us, isn't it? Yep. Where there's charcoal burners, there's always water nearby. All right. I'll go and ask somewhere else. Take care now. 
Now, I don't have the treasure map with me, but I remember there being a buried treasure somewhere up the hill here. So, I'm going to go have a look around. Um, I won't bore you with the whole searching. I'll probably have to edit out a lot of looking about. But let's see if I can, can find it, if I remember correctly. Past a burnt out hut and a hanged body. I think it was a grave. Now, yeah, let's see what we can see. Yay! I found it! Start digging. This is awesome. Yeah, uh, when you start up, you get five treasure maps. And this is one of them. I got pauldrons, Waffenrock, decorated boots, nice, lucky playing die, German bassinet, Malgroschen, recipe for poison, silver, and a short sword stinger, which does 79. Yes, please. This is a totally good score. Um, I'll just put those uh, pauldrons on. Thank you very much. Let's go back to the charcoal burners. Right, back at the charcoal burners after a little detour to pick up some goodies. Now we'll ride back to the stables yeah. in Neuhof. Looks like the sun's going down as well, so perhaps not the best time to strike out into the forests to try to find ginger. Right, back at Neuhof. Where is Bernard? Standing in the middle of the courtyard like a twit. My respects to you. Rubbish. Oh. I think Ginger is mixed up in it somehow. Hmm. Why do you say that? He acted suspiciously when I questioned him. Yeah. What do you mean? Shifty well, bastard. He was squirming and didn't really say anything. He might just have been in shock. True. But the hoof pick I found on the dead bandit in the woods is his. That yep. is fucking suspicious. Too right. And he's he scarpered. Right after we found those bandits in the woods. And I think I know where he went. Where? Charcoal burners. To the charcoal burners. He has friends there. We've got to find him. But if his friends really are hiding him, I doubt they'll talk to my men. You should search for him, Henry. Go. Before the trail turns cold, I'll send a report to Ratai. Very well, sir. Now, I noticed, uh, any work going here? Any chance of some work here, Captain? It all depends on what you're ready to do, my lion. As I'm sure you've noticed the roads around here are swarming with brigands. Sir Hanush has declared quite a reward for dealing with them. Interesting. So what do you think I should do about them? We Kill know them. about one of their Kill them all. It's to the east of Ratai in an abandoned mine. Mm. I don't really mind how you deal with them. Anyway, the leaders generally wear spurs, maybe like they're pretending they're nobility. Who cares? In any case, bring me the spurs, and I'll take it as proof that the deed's done. Very well. I'll see to it. Wait. In addition, Sir Hanush has mm -hmm. offered a reward for every bandit who's killed. So take a good sharp dagger. You'll get a bit extra for each ear you bring. So, uh... Does Very well. it have to be that a particular amusing. ear, or well, can I double dip? Well, as for amusement, I'd entertain myself by being very careful, lad. May the Lord watch over you. Okay. So, situation is... 
Ginger has run off to join the circus. I mean, hang out with some charcoal burners. And there is also some bandits that need taken care of. So somewhere up here is where the charcoal burners are and Ginger is probably there with him, with them. But, um, where was the details of the bandits? Quest log. Right. Oh, it's all the way down there. Okay, so... It's got a uh, bandit camp that's east of Ratai. Ratai, Ratai, I'm not sure how to pronounce it. So I'm going to head back to Ratai. Ratai. Um, do some armor repair, yeah. things like that. Sleep the night. And maybe in the morning, yeah. I'll go and hunt down some bandits. Yeah. Uh, that sounds pretty good. Uh, it seems to be getting a bit late. I think I will just uh, fast travel home and uh, cut this out and perhaps rejoin you in the morning. And good morning, everybody. I'm back at the uh, Rate Mill. I've just slept the night. Um, and as you see, I am all healed up from that walloping I took from that bandit in the woods. Now, I um, picked up uh, some nice items behind the uh, charcoal burners encampment. There was a buried treasure there and a burnt down building with a, uh, sorry, a campsite with a chest in it. And that yielded me some goodies. But when I've gone back to my chest at the mill, I've uh, picked up my treasure maps. So uh, there's that one. And actually that's the map to the treasure I just picked up. So that's good. That's all done. Uh, see, what's this one? Okay. So from Rate crossing the river, following a pathway round behind a rock and looks like a mine entrance. So that's uh, west of Rate. Must remember that for later. And that's Ujits and a grave beneath a tree. Next time we're in town, we'll have a look at that. Well, next time we're in Ujits. Um, oh gosh. Um, oh, hang on. Uh, Rate to the south there, and there's the mill. That's where we are right now. We cross the water uh, from the mill, head due west, and there's some treasure in some ruins. Must remember that when we go off in that direction. And what's this last one we have? Uh, mines. That might be skeletons. Really not sure where this one is though. Oh well. Right, so there's my treasure maps. Um, now there are some bandits. So what I might do 
is maybe have a go at them but uh, and then go to town and do vital repairs and get ready for going to look for ginger with the uh, charcoal burners along the river but I want to make some quick cash so I'm going to go and hunt down those bandits that yeah. Bernie just told me about. So they were crossing the river and heading east of Ratai. And there's a camp somewhere near a mine. So let's go and find them. As you can see on the um, compass dial, um, the top of the screen there, the red A is um, the indicator of where I'm supposed to go looking for these guys. So, riding pebbles my little pony along doesn't that look great that's Perkstein up there that's where um, Sir Ratzig is living at the moment uh, on loan from Sir Hans yeah Red Eye is pretty impressive when you look at it I think calling it a highly defensible position is understating things somewhat. It'd be a nightmare to attack that thing. Yeah. Okay, so the bandit camp is just through these trees. Now, I'm not really confident in my ability to take them all on in hand-to-hand -hand combat. So... Sneak on in, maybe lure one or two out. Whoa. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Two arms. Get over here. Hey, all of you, gather here. Raise the alarm. Is that all you've got? Yeah. Yep, that's all I got. Still coming? You're still coming. Come here, Lily Liver. No! Oh! You move. Here. 
A little tap there. No curva. Oh, 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 oh. Come on. Okay, let's loot him. Take it all and sort it out later. Right, well that was pretty good. That was the leader, so uh, anyone else is probably going to be a bit softer than he was. But was he wearing a, yes, a hauberk? Bit of chain armor, I will definitely take that. Now let's go back and see if there are any more of these banditos that I can finish off. And looking down, I only got a little scratch from uh, that bandit leader. It's pretty good. So I kind of think I'm fighting fit. Shut up, you dog. What the hell was that? Oh, it was me. Hello! <laughs> You're all running away. Very hard. Can I do those? No. There's the mine shaft. I'll just duck in here quickly. And maybe some of the other guys will come back. And I'll be able to jump on them. Eh! Yeah. Little bit of treasure there. That's alright. I'll take that. guys there's one of them who's there what's going on there what? well I know the pig turns up willingly for the slaughter Come on. Come on. Oh, ha! Oh, oh, dear God. Yeah, you meet him personally. Shield heavy. Nice. Let's do a little mercy kill. Oh, twist his head off like a twister. That's the ear for the bounty. I got a couple of arrows into him. Gamberson, good. I need a replacement one because mine is rubbish. Dirty brown hose. Uh, Chouses. Oh, yeah. Ooh, 
and some wine. Cheap wine and a three-day growth. Cheap wine and a three-day growth. Where are those other guys? Where are you? Climbing up the river? Is this where you went? I think there were two more. Two more that I saw but uh, didn't kill. Did they come up this way? If you find a path anywhere, it's always good just to follow it because they sometimes lead to really cool things. Um, this is going quite a ways off into the wilderness. Uh, uh, campsite! With a dead person. <laughs> dead person who's drunk poison. Right. Out of the way, Mark. Ducks. Easy lock picks. I like easy lock picks. I really like the lock picking game. Holy guacamole! My god! Noble Queerus with an armor protection of 23. That is huge! Noble boots that are really expensive. An odd playing dice. Whole bunch of money. Aesop Potion Recipe, Noble Short Sword, and Agile as a Weasel, which is a book that well, Agile as a Weasel 4 will let me uh, get some skill points later on in the game. I'm, I'm too much of a yeah noob to really be able to benefit from it at this point, but put it in my chest, keep myself busy. And before you know it, I'll be able to get myself an extra point of agility. Now, I do also have a book once I sit down to read, um, which is like Hercules and his diet. And when I do that, I will get, yeah, Hercules and his diet, I will get a strength point out of that, maybe. But, noble sword. Uh, Got to have an agility of 11. Can't quite use it yet, but that's a really good sword. Um, that's Stinger. Yeah, that's um, also a bit, uh, a bit too much agility needed on that one. But let's go back down to ah. the campfire. Maybe some of the bandits have returned. Ah. And I can pluck, you know, pick them off and uh, get the bounty for their ears. Hey, dog, come here. Dog. Uh, praise you. Good fella. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's my boy. And uh, give you some you food. Got for you. Gotta You'll keep you me. on side. Just don't take your hunting. Okay, I got a whole lot of um, hair meat that um, has a freshness of zero, so I imagine I've just got this bag of stink meat that's just for the dog, because I'm not going to eat it. Uh, 
back down the river. This will take us back to where we were. Right. So we're going to close in on the camp from the other direction this time. Doing the sneaky sneak. Corruption in the grass like a snake. Sneaky snake. One down. Okay. Dogwood bow. Marigold decoction, a lock pick. Pull out the bow and arrow again. So there's two more guys. They ran off this way. And that's one of them. There. Nobody but me. Yeah. Urgh. Let's just run into a tree, shall we? Yeah. Gotcha. There's one guy left, but I don't know. He's run off until the sunset or the sunrise. I guess we'll miss out on that uh, final ear. But um, let's fast travel, uh, see where Robart is. Let's see whether it's somewhere we want to fast travel. Righto, um, I've just uh, snipped out a bit of the boring bits of travelling back to Neuhof to report to Captain Bernard the destruction of the bandit camp. I also did uh, a little bit of equipment maintenance, selling off some booty in Rate, and uh, all cashed up, all armors repaired, looking pretty good. Anyhow, let's go and get the reward from Bernie for uh, 
handing in the spurs of the bandit leader and a couple of ears as well. God be with you. And with you. Took care You're of that camp, care of I did. Top. Where's the proof? Where's the Here trust in our relationship? Honestly. <sighs> Alia hunted, had hundred Groshen. Some folk were ambushed to mm. the west of her time, on the hill across the river from the gallows. It would be worthwhile to check it out. Understood. Might be indeed. Take care now. Um, hang on, I got some trophies for you. I have Hand some, over trophies. Uh, trophies. Let's see. What a collection! My boy, you're God's own avenging angel. Mm, 140 crushing. That's all right. Now I might I'd have like to develop enough skill with the sword Certainly. to do extra training. I'm not sure. No. Um, already done it. See, you can. Uh, train things at a beginner level that's up to level 5 um, and that's really cheap um, a bit more advanced uh, between level 5 and 10 and then advanced but you can only get training once in those uh, brackets of skill level uh, so I well, can't get any I... more training with sword take care now right What have I got to do now? Got to check the uh, quest log. Okay, it's looking for ginger up here amongst the charcoal burners. Um, there's uh, another bandit camp. Mightier than the sword. I might be able to learn to read. Actually, I think that's a priority. I'm going to learn to read. So I'm going to go to Ushitz and visit the scribe. Now, unfortunately, I've never been to Ushitz before, so I can't fast travel. So I'm going to have to do it the old-fashioned way and um, ride there. Now... Might give me the opportunity to check out a charcoal burner along the way, see if I can stumble across one of their camps. But uh, if not, I'll probably just... Um... Oh, let's see, where am I on the map again? No, that's heading that direction. Got to head that direction. Looks like I've got to ride past some... Charcoal burners, anyway. So, I'll head off that way now. Yeah. And uh, edit out this boring bit until I arrive at some charcoal burners. Oh, looks like I found uh, a charcoal burner camp. This is handy. Let's see if any of them are no ginger. Don't forget. Charcoal burner. I'm honoured that a knight such as you takes an interest in me. I'm glad you're I'm honored. searching for a stable boy from Neuhof. They call him Ginger. I know him right enough, but I don't know where he is now. He's run away from the stud farm. I have to find him. Well, he's definitely not here. Try the other charcoal burners camp downstream. Maybe he's there. May the Lord watch over. Okay, well. He did seem like a bit of an honest kind of guy. Me. I hope I can be of help to you, Knight. I'm looking, looking for, for Ginger. Ginger from Neuhof. Do you know anything about him? I know him. What do you want of him? There's a few questions I need to ask him. Well, he'll have to go somewhere else to find him. He doesn't come here much. Hmm. Well, who does so where does he usually go if not here? You think we're the only charcoal burners in these woods? No. Probably not. But this is a big forest, and I don't have time to look under every stone in it. And you don't need to look under every stone. All you have to do is follow the river, and you might just run into another camp. Hmm. I really must speak with him. 
A murder was committed at the stud farm, and that boy probably knows who did it. I have to get him to talk. And you think he had a hand in it? Hard to say. He ran away, but on the other hand, it seems he stabbed one of the attackers. Well, when you put it like that... It's clearly urgent business. Mm -hmm. I do know him. Uh, not personally, but I've seen him around. He's friends with the charcoal burners down by Townburg. I know he hangs around with the twins there. Downstream by Townburg? Somewhere by the castle? If you follow the river to the west, okay. you're bound to run into them. Oh, one good. more thing. Yes? Some other men have been around asking about him, but they weren't as uh, convincing as you. Good luck to you. Right, okay. I was going to go to Ushitz first to learn how to read. But as there are some guys already looking for Ginger, I think I should probably um, find Ginger first. Yeah. Let's just go up and around. Yeah. yeah. I'll get my bow out just in case. And yeah. follow the stream to the west. Um, yeah, that's the turn off to the shoots. But I will. Hmm. Where's that path lead? Well, oh, remember that for later. Yeah. Yeah. Whee! Yeah. Uh, I'm a little Don't bit drunk. Oh shit. Uh, out of there. Is somebody coming for me? Is humans fighting someone? Humans fighting bandits? There's a bandit who just took out that cumin. Beszarás. És pont amikor kedvem lenne valakiből kiverni a lelket. Shit. Shit. Come on, you bastard. <laughs> Quick, weapon swap. He's all armored up. You want to go do it, my god, me? Come on. Come on. Come on. Shit. Come on. 
Oh, oh man, he's giving it to me. That's better. Mace is a wee bit shorter than a sword. I keep missing. Hey, have a good one. Warhammers? I like them a lot. And bandage, man, burst, quality arrows. Uh, Alright, pick up some other goodies. Leather gloves are always good. Kais, beef jerky. And a dagger. I don't have one of them. Right. Okay, I'm not sure what I'm going to do. Let's see if there's still trouble down this way. And if so, should I just clear off? Can I pick over the bones? Not sure. Yeah. I saw how difficult it was for me to take on that one guy. I certainly don't want there to be three or four just hanging around here. Now, there's a body there. Merchant's longsword. Bandit, bandages. Ooh, one of the nice hats. Uh, that a guy, fashionable black. Oh, I might as well just grab everything. Anyone around? Okay. I'm about to lose daylight. Yeah. And that will not be good. So let's just talk with these guys and find out. They know where Ginger is. Put this away so I'm not as threatening. How hungry am I? Oh, pretty good still. Coal burner twin. Uh, sorry. Charcoal burner. Radan. Leave me be. Ugh. Okay. They're all turning in for the night. And I think I really need to do the same. So what I'll do is I'm going to fast travel to Talmberg and spend the night there and come back in the morning. Pop. Off I go. 
please, 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 please don't get ambushed. Please don't get ambushed. Like, really pretty please, don't get ambushed. Alright. Right. Here I am, Telmberg, but I'm just going to go down into the town. Yeah. To the inn. To the innkeeper. Good health, dear. Place to sleep. Can I sleep here? Aye, oh, there's room here. For how long? For a few how nights. How about if I pay you for several nights? All right. Money up front, though. It's always good to have like a a, a base hmm. up north. That's quite a lot. And can we discuss the price? Town pretty central up north, so. Is this enough? He'll establish well now, a little more. Establish we'll a face up here. You like it here? Like sleeping on a cloud, it is. Excellent. God be with you. Now, what I'm going to do is. Get my torch out. Because I can't see Bo Diddley. a bed sleep and save now ladies and gentlemen i'm going to uh call an end to this session i would, had hoped i would have got a bit further on than i did but um found the next group of charcoal burners and hopefully they'll have a lead for me finding ginger and uh, i'll be going back to them in the morning but thank you very much for taking on this adventure with me and uh, joining Henry as he travels around a Bohemia and makes his way in the world. Anyhow, you all take care. Love to all. And I'll see you at the next episode. Ciao.